What is going on, buddy? Dan on filter checking out. I'm excited for this. Typo negative. It's been fucking too long. World coming down. The reason I'm excited, because I, I, I think I've heard three typo. This will be the fourth. I think I think the number is three. I think I've heard three. Uh, and two of them are absolutely my shit, especially in praise of Bacchus. That one actually uh, on the All Hollowed playlist gets more play than probably any other song. I'd just be chilling, like, you know what? Before I like ride out, like, you know what? Let me, I'm gonna put on Typo Negative. I wanna hear about Bacchus again. I, <laughs> I don't know why. I love that song. Absolutely love it. And the other one that's my jam is, uh, oof. The title is tough, so let me see if I can get it. If You Don't Kill Me. Then I have to kill you? Is that what it is? It's, it's a huge acronym, but I think that's the name. Also a sweet song. It's one of the best titles of all time. <laughs> that's a great title. Like he just flat out just says it. Let's check this out. Mike, appreciate you, homie. If you guys have any requests, hit me up. Oh, and as always with lyric videos, if the lyrics are wrong, I didn't make it. Don't blame me. Wasn't my fault. not two lines in and already he's getting his hand around my heart his voice is phenomenal what uh peter peter r.i.p I, I think he's gone love this man's voice it's like a he it's like heavier jim morrison like more modern jim morrison Damn. Thing. Not only is his voice like the voice of God, but also, isn't it? It's like it's like if you imagine if this is what your conscience sounded like, it, it would sound like him. It's one of those things where everyone thinks their voice sounds one way in their head, and then when they hear it back to them for the first time, it's like, what? I thought I sounded like this guy. You don't. You don't. But <laughs> not that. But they have. I love the writing. Like, it's damn near poetry. Very well done.
Talk to me. I've said other songs before. I love when a songwriter, when they're honest, blame yourself for your troubles sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Like, so many songs, is blaming your ex. Fuck, fucking shit up. I love it when they blame themselves. He's like, it's me. That's why it ling- the pain lingers more when you know it's my fucking fault. Good stuff. He, like, the world's coming down. And he's blaming himself. Time to be honest sometimes, man. Makes the song better. Cowbell? Nice scent in the background. Talk! Talk to him. And that's him in the background, I guess. They, they've got him layered in the back doing kind of, what would you call that? Like that, that monk-like priest choir sound? Espirito Sante's thing that they, that they have in so many movies. Kind of sounds like what he's doing. He's not doing that, but it sounds like it. It's nice. It all started with a line of him saying he's like, he's disregarding being human. He's like, he's, he's done. That sound starts from then on.
wrapping up. I completely forgot that the song was World Coming Down. It's It's been that long in between since the, I guess the chorus, last time he did the World Coming Down thing. Holy shit. It's been like four minutes. What's he saying there? Sounds like he's saying good luck, but I don't think that's what he's saying. Good stuff, man. I like the style. I really like typo negative because they're different. They're different than what you, basically than anything you hear of the last, what, 20 something years? <laughs> 20 to 30 years? Everyone wants faster pace with their rock and higher, like rock to metal music, rock and above. They want faster pace, bigger bangs, bigger drops. I am a part of that group that wants that. I love that. A big bang, a big drop, I lose my shit. It's fantastic. But it is nice for that change of pace that 
it's kind of a modern, a little heavier version of of Pink Floyd and the Doors from back in the day. Slow, just give it a nice simple rhythm, have a nice synth in the back, put some good lyrics, and just really smooth vocals. And let's just ride. And you just kind of... It, I, I hate this generation ruining every word by burying it into the ground. But it is kind of a vibe. You don't get many like bands or songs anymore that I would actually say, that's a fucking vibe. That's a mood. Typo negative literally is. Like you just want to like sit back and like not even, just nod your head a little bit. Smoke. You know, chill. Drink. There we go. There it is something I can legally do. And just listen to them. And just relax. Not many bands are like that anymore. Like, Frankly, they're not like that anymore either. R.I.P. But you know what I mean. Like that this this type of music used to be huge back in the when when acid was everywhere <laughs> back back in the seventies and eighties this was huge sixties too now it's like again Floyd ruled the world with this type of slow type of stuff Mother have you guys heard Mother by Pink Floyd that's a fucking masterpiece she literally turns heel like halfway through the song she was the villain. Anyway, great song. Uh, we'll break that down sometime. But hit like, subscribe. Typo negative. Let's fucking go. And again, I, I, I'll say it every time. when Because it's, it's rare. So anytime a, a song ha does it, I'll shout it out. When someone blames themselves in their own song, bonus points. Love that. It just makes it more rela relatable because it's more fucking realistic. 90% of your problems... Because of you, buddy. It's because of you.